we first started um, when I went down to El Salvador because my husband grew up in El Salvador and I wanted to, you know, see where he came from um, and kind of experience the culture. I fell in love with the kids. Um, the kids don't judge and they're very forgiving and I don't speak any Spanish so, you know, they were very helpful and I saw the school and I saw all the poverty, gang activity and the violence and, um, you know, it broke my heart. So um, I partnered with a local charity and um, this past year we finally got all our ducks in a row and this past January we actually opened our school. There's 125 students, 25 kids per grade, first through fifth grade. So one thing that's lacking at the school in El Salvador is a fully functional library. So here in Twistburg, we're doing a book drive with the Friends of the Library and also um, students in the districts. Once again, bringing in the kids, we will be doing um, a project with Girl Talk. And what it is, is high school girls actually mentor middle school girls. So I had Mrs. Amendes for seventh grade in English. She's really making an impact not only in Twinsburg, but in the world. What they'll be doing is creating a quilt. So when we take these pieces down to El Salvador, um, and once the students down there complete their quilt pieces, we'll have them sewn together to kind of bridge the American and the El Salvadorian culture together. Education is very important to me. I felt that that's my calling, and um, I wanted to help the kids out there as much as I could. So starting the school, giving not only the kids the resources, but the teachers, and that's why I keep coming back year after year to see those smiling faces.